All right, welcome back to Venusville Plays Hex Shards of Fate. We are again attempting to beat the same fire-breathing wormoid. These gnomes are making it difficult. I didn't mean draw first. Damn it, I want to keep that hand because we got holiday. Ugh, let's try it. I keep I hate keeping with only one land. Here we go, we get a primal shard. Player spell sprite. Player holiday. Player shield trainer. I probably should have started doing the holiday thing. Yeah, we're gonna just turn into a prairie scout. Tap target attacking troop gets plus one plus one this turn. Okay. Let's try the soothsaying. Primal shard. All right, we'll get rid of a lost now. I need to get my holiday over over one defense so that the wormoids aren't killing it when it comes out. There we go, now it's a wild child. It's 2-2. Put out Primal Shard. Put out Runeweb Infiltrator. So spell power, yeah, let's soothsay again. Spellwalker Stewart got rid of Lost Gnome. Whew, man, there is some stuff tunneling out there. Let's do this again. 3-2 Dark Spire Enforcer. I'm sure if we keep leveling it up we'll eventually get something with awesome abilities. Yeah, we got Spiderling. Get that down. Let's level up the holiday again. Savage Lord. Start of your turn with card. Your deck is dinosaur put into play. Dinosaur troops you control at speed. Aw. I thought it would be awesome. Turn out to be nothing that will affect us. Everyone attack. And we'll put out the steward, which might trigger. Yeah, okay. One damage to the shield trainer. That's unfortunate. But you know what? We can win. I think. Oh, he killed my sprite. We needed that.
Well, I messed up a little bit, but we might, we still might be able to win next turn. Oh, I had the mana. I feel really stupid right now. One damage to me, okay. Can't be blocked, alright. I'll take it. Make the Stewart fly. One damage to me. We did it. Get out of here. Bleedy blam. I really love that holiday, man. That holiday is great. Bleedy blam with the runaway Sam. Still, now what do we have here? Oh, just a regular warm white. Okay. This one, when warm white's enter play, put burning on me. I would like to play first. Yeah, we'll keep that. It's not the best, but it's not terrible. He can add tunneling counters. He doesn't even get to put an extra worm I wonder what the burning counters do. I guess we'll find out pretty soon. Phoenix Guard, Spell Power, Soothsay. I need to remove those from my deck. I really need to. Those don't do what I thought they did. Let's get these guys over. The Romoids definitely teach you to play creatures in your second main phase. Alright, perfect. We got a throwback for when that thing comes up. So for now, we'll just keep attacking. If they do so when the thing comes up we can just throw it back. Um since he didn't put anything out, let's sapphire or the Phoenix Guard Trainer. Pass priority, throw these guys at your face. I guess we'll put out a lost gnome. There we go. 11-6. Play resource underground, tumbling minus one. Enters play, one dash each opposing troop for each wormoid you control.
Well, that killed a bunch of my guys. Now I have a burning counter, I guess. I don't see it anywhere, and I don't know what it does. The Roback. There's nothing anywhere to tell me what the burning counters do. All right, buffalo and leper gnome or lost gnome. <laughs> Leper Gnome's wrong game. Oh no. Well, at least they gave us morphology. <laughs> it's kind of funny, actually. Shield trainer? Yeah, we'll keep it. Attackers, get over there. Whoops. I think we've got this. Yeah, we're morphology that back to your hand, turn it into a spell instead. And we'll take the four. Power of Ruby, gain two charges, okay. You know what, let's just win. We did it! Tune in tomorrow and we will continue to take these 20 gnomes across the desert.